It's workout number 56. As a salesperson at Wilson's Furniture, Tony has the choice between two options for receiving monthly pay. It says, with one option, he receives a base salary of $1,151 and gets 7% commission on the sales. With the other option, he gets $500 and an additional 14% commission on the sales. What amount of sales must he have for the pay for the two options to be equal? So we're looking for the amount of sales. So we'll start by letting X be equal to the dollar amount, so money in sales. How much he makes, uh, how mu what's the amount in sales that he uh, has? And we want the two options to be equal. So let's see, with one option, he receives a base salary of 1151 plus and then 7% commission on the sales. So 7% of the sales. So of means multiply. So 0 0.07 times x. This has to be equal to the other option, which is $500. That's the base salary plus 14% commission on the sales. So 14% of the sales. So of x. All right, so now we just have to solve this for x. Um, let's be careful here. So we'll subtract the 500. So these cancel. So let's see, 1151 minus 500. I'm not going to take any chances. I'm going to use my calculator. So I got 651 plus 0.07x equals 0.14x. Okay. Then you do minus 0.07x minus 0.07, just to get the x by itself, that's the goal. So we get 651 equals, and this is going to be 0.07x. And then to finish, you just divide by 0.07, divide by 0.07. So x equals, so I'm going to put this in my calculator, 651 divided by 0.07. Wow, big number, so $9,300. That's the amount of sales uh, the amount in sales that he must make in order for the two options to be equal. So I hope this video has been helpful. That's it.